So I'm laying in my bed and I've just nutted. My sheets are crusty. What a great start to the day. No, it's not even crusty. It's slippery. <laughs> I'm so open on this channel, bro. It's all, oh, my sheets are, you, you know what I'm talking about. If you used to be a or if you still are. What a great start to the day. <laughs> I feel so high energy, not. And so I sit there, but well, lie there in my calm that's just drying. Staring at the ceiling, thinking about what I've just done and how I'm such a piece of shit and oh man this is so bad and oh, I've relapsed and oh, bro I've probably made it to like 90 days and I relapsed oh fucking oh man I'm a piece of shit and all oh, this and this and this whatever you're feeling sorry for yourself about and you're telling yourself these things in your brain that oh I'm a piece of shit and oh it's so bad and I relapsed and no fab and oh I'm such a piece of shut the f*** up Get out of your bed, hit some push-ups, and crack on. Something bad happens, you feel really bad about yourself. What you do is you don't sit there and do nothing and feel sorry for yourself. I know it feels really bad that you relapsed on NoFam 90 days or whatever. Don't make, don't count the days, make the days count. <laughs> okay, yeah, I know it feels really bad that you're lying there, that you've come, or that you've... You're looking back and how inconsistent you've been, you've worked out in ages, you feel sorry for yourself, you feel really bad. You're telling yourself all of these negative things in your head. There is zero point in doing that. There is zero point because you're just gonna make yourself feel even shittier and you're just gonna keep lying there doing nothing. So what, something bad has happened. So what, you feel really shit about yourself because you've been inconsistent. Guess what you do, you don't sit there and tell yourself negative things in your brain. Of course, yeah, you mean a piece of shit then and there, but that's not what you do. You don't keep telling yourself these negative things. You know what you do? You crack on. You start doing some positive things to create positive momentum. You don't want to continue the bad momentum. That is just going to keep you in the, in your rut. So that is going to keep you feeling shit about yourself. So guess what? You crack on. You hop on the ground from your crusty cum, cum bed and start hitting some push-ups. You crack on. Create the positive momentum. Start doing some push-ups. Hop in the cold shower. Hit your workout right after and start doing your schoolwork. Start doing maybe one minute of studying, then two minutes, then three minutes. Keep the momentum in your favor by sitting there, lying there, and telling yourself bad things. That keeps you in a negative state because you are literally putting yourself in a negative state. Instead, put yourself in a positive state and create positive momentum by hopping on the ground, doing some push-ups, and then telling yourself that I'm so great, look at me. I'm getting strong, I'm doing push-ups and I'm a G, look at me, I'm back to it already, no negative thing can, can keep me down, I'm just, I'm just so great, look at me bro, I relapsed on NoFap and still I'm studying for a couple hours and I'm still working hard because it doesn't matter what you did before, it doesn't matter, it already happened, don't keep yourself in that negative state, create some positive momentum by dropping down, doing some push-ups, and telling yourself positive things after that because you just did a positive thing and that positive thing that positive affirmations you're telling yourself in your brain after you've done the positive thing is going to create more positive momentum and you're going to forget that you even relapsed because this happened to me a couple of weeks ago I, I don't even remember bro i literally was lying in my cum stained bed feeling sorry for myself and then i said what am i doing is being negative telling yourself all these things about yourself going to work in your favor no it's not because you're going to continue lying there feeling sorry for yourself and taking no action so you get up you do the push-ups i tell you pump pump your chest hold yourself with some good posture you've just done fucking 50 push-ups you've just gone and hopped in the cold shower big yourself up you've just gone and gone for that run even though you just relapsed because it doesn't make a difference you're such a G that no matter what bad thing happens, it doesn't matter because you're going to get up and continue anyways. So, conclusion of this video. Stop feeling sorry for yourself. That doesn't work. You're just going to keep staying in a bad momentum by saying t terrible things to yourself. Sure, you did a terrible thing, but it doesn't matter. You don't tell yourself those things. You get back up. You do the task that you need to do. You create that positive momentum and you start feeling good again. Even though you relapsed a couple hours, it doesn't matter. 
whatever thing, bad thing that's happened that you're feeling down about, it doesn't matter. If you just crack on and get, create some positive momentum, you forget about it. And you continue on with your life. It doesn't make a difference when you ruminate on it. It doesn't change the fact that you did what you did. You put it behind you and you just crack on. Create some positive momentum. Then you can tell yourself good things and you feel good about yourself again. So if you're on this video and before this video you are feeling bad about yourself, you are feeling like you're a piece of shit, get off this video, crack on, do some push-ups, create the positive momentum, tell yourself good things about yourself and you're going to just start feeling good again. It's that simple. Hope that helps you bro.